I recently had an amazing opportunity to speak at a Senate hearing addressing the shortage of minorities in healthcare. It was such a random and unexpected opportunity, and of course I had to say yes. So I hopped on a plane to Washington, D.C. I got to stay at the George, which is a lovely hotel, by the way, and my room was amazing. In the morning, I got ready and set off to the Senate hearing. Prior to getting to the hearing, I met with Representative Richard Neal, who offered great advice on how to speak in public. Stepping into the Senate House felt surreal for someone who loves history, politics, and government. Up until this point, I wasn't nervous, but I'm not gonna lie. As soon as I sat down to begin to testify, the nerves set in. But I told myself, girl, you got this, and read my testimony. I told my story as well as gave recommendations on what, in my opinion, would help increase the minority workforce in healthcare. The senators were incredibly welcoming, and I even had the chance to snap a photo with Senator Sanders. Afterwards, I went on a tour of the Capitol. Standing next to the statues of Rosa Parks and Martin Luther King, after discussing the minority health care shortage, was profound. Capturing moments from the best views in D.C. made it a once-in-a-lifetime experience, and I'm grateful for the opportunity to advocate and inspire those around me.